Hello once again YouTube, I want to welcome you all back to The Domain. It is a bright and sunny day in Hong Kong, and oh boy am I excited for today's video. We've got all of these Maverick packs. I'm talking a full set, complete all eight figures. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ooh, buddy. I am so excited about this. You can actually see these blind bags. I received them in my latest haul video, which is actually doing really well. Thank you so much for the support. And oh yes, look at these Maverick series. This Maverick is one of my absolute favorites. I mean, there are so many good figures in Maverick. When you compare it to like like Warrior, there's there's some good figures, but Maverick. Maverick is the king, look at all them, and they're so stylized, they all work together with similar color palettes, blacks and blues, and some grays, ah, oh, they're fantastic. FYI, first disclaimer, you may notice there is some tape, the codes are from all different runs of the figure, so they vary very greatly, so I wanted to make sure I had a complete set, and ha. Oh, it, it feels it feels so good to have some weighty blind bags in your hand, you know, especially when you know that every single figure you see you're going to pull. That's always a really fun thing. Without further ado, we've got one here. Snip it right open. I'll also be giving away a Maverick at the end of this video, so stay tuned to find out how to win. Three, two, one. What have we got first? Whoa, we've got Billy the Grunt. Oh no, sorry. No, for the law experts out here. This is Charles the Grunt, the ever-expanding universe of the Domain. I do hope to give a lot of my Grunts names. Grunts are the most wonderful thing about the Halo universe. They're so strange. They're such a weird enemy to include in a game. Especially, like, I think where first-person shooters lose audiences nowadays is there's no comedic enemies, you know? Like, everybody's just a really hardcore baddie. You want some comedic villains and grunts are just the perfect ones. I mean grunts, brutes, elites, they're all pretty comedic, but grunts, they hold a special place in everyone's heart. Charles the Grunt. Charles was born on Earth, interestingly enough. He was found in a spaceship that crashed. A small village girl took him in and raised him like, like, like a little pet, like a little animal. Uh, she put him in a cage from her old dog that passed away the year before. So, so you know, Charles filled a void of <laughs> this girl losing her dog. I don't know what I'm talking about. Maybe you think I'm losing the plot a little bit. But you know what? I feel like I'm on track. And blind bag openings, they're always the best way for me to get stuff off my chest. For me to tell you what's going on in my life future projects, schedules for videos, engagement and reactions to old videos. It's the perfect place for me to just unwind. I, I've said before that actually like I, I use these blind bag openings as a way to get things off my chest. It's actually quite therapeutic for me as well. Okay, there is Charles the Grunt. He was actually a pet for this girl hiding in a cage in the back of her house all the way up until the battle for New Mombasa, where he was unfortunately set free and they never saw each other again. Please do let me know in the comments which is your favorite Maverick figure? Which one would you like to win? I think my favorite is probably the ODST, but I've actually got three of them now. I've not got most of these. I've still not seen that recon or the elite, so they're very nice. Okay, three, two, one. It's the NMPD police officer, but it ain't the sergeant. It's just the standard officer. Yeah, these NMPD officers are super easy to build. They lack some of the details the previous NMPD officers have had, especially like some printed decals on their shoulders, but they're still really nice, very good way to army build, and I really like the blue undersuit, I think it makes the figure pop really nicely. So it's a really nice time to be on my YouTube channel right now, I'm seeing a lot of sudden growth. I actually, you know, the, the views were slowing down a little bit while I transitioned to Hong Kong because I really wasn't uploading. But now I've got a really good schedule, I'm uploading every two days, sometimes every day, and the views are getting quite good again. I'm very happy to see you guys are engaged with my content. Okay, here we go, number three, what have we got? It's the Black Elite. They're really cool, but they're not so good for army building, because, you know, you only really want, like, one officer, one commando. I think, like, definitely the Storm Elites and the elite ultras are quite good for army building. This is interesting. I thought his 
armor was the exact same color as his legs. Like, I thought it was just two block colors, but it's actually quite different. This is nice. I've built hundreds of these figures, and I still get the legs confused sometimes. Very nice figure. I love these elites. I mean, I think elites are probably the best thing that Mega Constructs have done in new articulation. You really get an idea of the size of them, especially their dominance over grunts. It's really nice to see that size difference. Very nice elite. Look at that. That's three out of eight, and we're feeling young. Number four is, let me let me guess, is it gonna be the NMPD officer? Maybe it's another ODST. It's the, ooh, it's the blah, 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 Athlon. Very nice. The Spartan Athlon. I basically, I, I didn't even pay attention to that figure. Okay, really cool. I'm looking forward to getting that recon. I will have as many super articulation Halo 3 recons as possible. They're so badass. Nice effect on his chest there. Sort of basketball helmet. I've seen a lot of people hate on the Spartan Athlon. It's actually one of my favorite Halo 4, Halo 5 armors. I've made it very clear, abundantly clear in different videos that I don't really like Halo 4 or 5 armor. Or I think, I think certainly like people do like it, but people that didn't grow up with Bungie era armor. I built that one really quick. And it comes with a Halo 4-5 Needler, really nice. One thing I do respect about the Mega Constructs blind bags, I don't know how long they've been doing it for, but they've definitely started including a wide variety of weapons. You used to, especially with old blind bags, things like Series 3, you would get a lot of repeating weapons. Just, I mean, to save money, makes sense. But now they've clearly started, I mean, they've got so many weapons in their arsenal, they can do whatever they want. Okay, next one, we've got number five. Can you guess in the live chat which figure it is? In three, two, one, were you correct? Haha, <laughs> it's the Spartan Recon, fantastic. That is a really nice light blue. I know some people aren't all about this kind of blue. I like it. Let's pop that head on straight away. Oh, he looks so good. Can has Recon. Mummy, can I have Recon please? Bungie emailed me and said I could have recon if I provided our address and banking details. I said to my girlfriend, she was interested when we logged on to Halo 3 and the main menu, it says, do not give your account information to people claiming they're Bungie employees. She was like, is that really a problem? I was like, back in the day, yes, it really was. He's got the shotgun, which I guess is the same as the NMPD trooper, but it is a different color. Look at that, that is one of my favorite recons. That is probably my favorite Maverick that I've opened. Gorgeous, look at that. Really nice gold visor too. It You can feel the Halo 3 coursing through its veins. Very nice. Okay, next one. One, two, three, sing with me. Counting with the domain. I've seen that as a few different comments. It must be like a meme or something. Okay, three, two, one. Oh, do you want me to do a meme? Uh, should I be trendy with the kids? Uh, JJ the Spartan, three, two, one. Oh, that's Poggers. <laughs> I really don't even know what Poggers means, but a lot of people seem to like him. I, I think, I feel like the Discord is now going to be filled with people like, oh my god, Simon said Poggers. Okay, there we go. Look at that. Such a nice figure. Okay, the Spartan Rogue. When I first opened this figure, I mistook it for Sese Refumi. My hands, they always naturally drift upwards, and I know sometimes, certainly when I'm editing it, I'm like, really, Simon? You just stuck your hands right in the air. You didn't even put the figure on sh in shot for half of it. Oh, maybe that should be the giveaway. Would anyone like to win a Spartan Rogue? Okay, the camera always has trouble focusing on the transparent and the translucent figures. It's quite funny. That is one, two, three, four, five, six. Six going strong. We got two more to go. I also hope you enjoyed yesterday's video. It was a bit of a strange one, and I know it's not gonna be the most popular, but heck, I enjoyed making it. It was some ODST jazz to a typhoon that came through Hong Kong recently. Literally, I was looking out of my window as my girlfriend was actually on a ferry heading towards the mainland or towards Hong Kong Island. I saw this typhoon sweep in and literally her boat and all of Hong Kong disappeared. It was very ghostly. So I filmed the whole thing and I put ODST Jazz over it because you know what? ODST Jazz has actually been helping me recently through um, just through all the decisions I gotta make in life. When I'm feeling melancholy, when I'm feeling like I, I need to get my head screwed on, you know, uh, deference for darkness or, or neon night, they all, they all help me through. They, they actually clear my head a lot. Um, I do always thank Halo Music for like 
putting me in the right headspace, clearing my mind, clearing my thoughts. That is the fourth silver ODST that I've opened on this channel now, only in the space of like a week or so. And do let me know what kind of content you are enjoying, guys. I've got a lot of the Halo Infinite sets and I am gonna push out reviews, but like I'm just enjoying doing my own thing right now, to be honest. A lot of people are doing reviews, especially Brickman117, and white background, plain reviews, like they are fantastic. They're a beautiful format, very stylized but they're not my thing. I like comedy, I like bright colors, I like out of the box thinking kind of reviews. So I'm gonna push them out slowly. Last Maverick for today. What's it gonna be? I think we I think we all know what it's gonna be. I think there's only one left for it to be. It's the NMPD officer. Look at that. And it comes with an SMG as well, very nice. This is one of the first examples I think of like two figures being made for each other in a blind bag set. Like, these two NMPD officers, they were a match made in heaven, they were clearly designed by the same person, they are awesome for that reason. And yeah guys, straight after this video I'm gonna record my next snap build video. It's not one of my highest viewed videos, but it's definitely the video that I've received the most feedback from, like the most, wow this is a cool idea, I wanna see the next episode of this. For these snap builds I have to record for a long period of time, and I, like right now I am, I am sweating. It is hot in Hong Kong. But would you look at that, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's do a snap build, shall we? Let's do it. Get off, get off. There we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight Maverick series packs. They look beautiful. Like what a fantastic set. They look so good together. We've got these two NMPD officers. They are two pieces of the same puzzle. They look fantastic together. We've got this Recon and Rogue. They're out of the same game. They look awesome. Oh no, they all look fantastic. So, I'm sure you're wondering, how can I win one of these, Simon? Well, I will be giving away this sealed... <laughs> that Warrior series pack is not happy with me today. Goodness me, you are fighting me. I will be giving away this Maverick series pack, and if you would like, I would also give away that rogue figure as well, because I definitely have two of those. So if you would like to win a Maverick series pack or that rogue figure, all you need to do is comment down below saying blind bags are awesome, like this video, and subscribe. And you know what, if you wanna turn on that bell, that would help me a lot too. Today is a big day, I am officially launching my Patreon which is a very interesting thing for me. I don't really like going down that road, but I am unemployed in Hong Kong and it would help out a lot. And I can offer a lot of perks and benefits as well. I'm gonna have exclusive videos there. I'm gonna have loads of behind the scenes content, loads of opportunities to talk with me on Discord, have a good time. There are so many perks. So please do head over to Patreon, give me a little checkout and feel no pressure at all to donate. It's entirely up to you. This was another video with the domain. I hope you like the new logo, and I've got some huge news coming this weekend about a brand new Facebook group. It's gonna be huge, and it's gonna be a way to actually be in my videos on a monthly basis. It's gonna be awesome. So this was another video, yeah, with the domain. Thank you so much for tuning in today. You have a great day out there, whatever you're doing. I know life might be a little tough right now. Things are always very uncertain in 2020, but you know what? I'm always here to throw out awesome content. I waver sometimes when I'm thinking whether or not I need a full-time job and whether or not this is taking up too much of my time. But when I get messages off you guys saying how much my videos help you, how much they support you through these difficult times, it motivates me tenfold to make more content and up my game day after day. So thank you guys from the bottom of my heart. Stay awesome, and I'll see you next time. I have the, 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 you know, they're all signing off. They're equally cool. Signing off with all of the Maverick series. Rawr.